What is Too that? Too much power and the whole place could blow. So be quick. Wait, what? Oh, uh, whoa! What? What? We just read this shit. This what? Why don't you wear one? Oh, that's the only one. And if anyone stands a fighting chance in there, it's you. Forget about fashion and go. Alright. Will do, Ignis. A precious source of power. Clear out the demons and stabilize the generators. Fam, we're playing as Noctis again. <laughs> Testing. Do you read me? Yeah, I read you. Just I read wanted you to thank you for offering to clear out those demons. That'll give me uh -huh. time to treat this mithril for you. Oh, so you're treating the Mithril. Okay. There's a hunter who went in right ahead of you. I imagine there are too many for one to handle. Uh-huh. But two of you should be fine. Okay, that sounds a like a plan. Up, we're getting some unstable readings from the generators inside. Uh-huh. What is too that? Too much mean? power and the whole place could blow. So be quick. Wait, what? Will do. Oh man, we're in for a serious problem now, aren't we, fam? So, you might back up. I thought we were partners. That's Gladio! Right the place is crawling with demons. Wait a second. You sound familiar. Oh, Save the talk. We got hunting Gladio! To do. Now, if we're done with the introductions, follow me. Really? Uh oh, that's sweet. Oh, let's go, buddy. Okay. Oh, look at this place. That's so cool. There they are. What the heck? You ready it's a to goblin? Oh yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Ah, punk. Yeah, I can't touch this. Some pretty fancy moves you've got there. Uh, to destroy these guys really quickly before something bad happens. I heard that it's supposed to go bad or nuclear in this place. From what I guessed. Can't touch this. What 
are you doing? Try this. Ooh, had all of them. Like got them. Nice job. It didn't disappoint. When have I ever? <laughs> Keep it up. Will do. Now let's scram. Oh, they both know they're here. Oh, silver bangle. Okay. So we cleared out the place, but is it still gonna go nuclear like they were saying? Great work in there. As promised, here's your mithril. And uh thank you for your hard work. Sure. Oh, so hey, it's not gonna guy. go nuclear? So the hunter who went on ahead. The one and only. <laughs> How you been, fellas? What's not up, bad. man? Oh, someone did a number on you, though. You should see the other guy. Anyway, I'm back. And better than ever. Oh, you do? You have scars on your head. What happened? Knocked? Gladdy? I can't believe it! Hey. Eris. Thanks for looking after her, Dustin. So, Gladdy, did you apologize to Knocked for storming off like that? He made it up to me in there. The power plant? Oh, so you got your hands on some mithril. In that case, I'll go deliver it to Sid. You'll probably want to freshen up first anyway. Come and meet me and Kayam when you're ready. Alright, cool. Alright, we are back. <sighs> really looking forward to Iris' cooking. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Aw, oh, don't be that way. It's different when a girl cooks for you. <laughs> uh, that's very true, that's very true. <laughs> Alright. Back to Cape Kayam and that weird looking lighthouse that I really like fam It's really beautiful up here. I have to admit, but I thought oh, this is it. That's what is that? Orienting checkpoint relish a treat made from the sprinklings of wheat, but the taste of victory lies further ahead Seek the fire wielding matron of the wade Guarding the gem of the shell on the sun. That's it. What's up Biggie? Golden I've come up with guide. a new recipe. <laughs> Can't wait to try it. Yes, let us dine on delicacies better than cup noodles. All right, continuing on. This is so pretty. So now we oh, so we have to go up that way. But this is their cabin, right? Let's get a shot with the lighthouse. Hair blowing in the breeze. We'll be seaside supermodels. Yeah, let's do that. Yes, definitely. Come on, man. Oh, I'm excited. Seaside supermodels it is, then. Oh, yeah. Seaside supermodels. <laughs> I want to do this real quick, fam, because I love pictures. Hold on. Iris, what's up? Hey there. Uh, give me a step. We made somebody. a little grave for Jared. You should stop by. I'm sure he'd like to see you. Be careful. Oh. Wait, where's the... Hold on, where's the grave? I want to pay my respects. That Aranea, she's a little different. Certainly doesn't fit the Imperial Army profile. Is it around here? I wonder where this uh, graveyard is. Like, there's the photo op. Oh, she's tilling land. They're actually doing farm work right now. Where's the grave, though? That's my question. Well, we'll take a photo first. And then we'll find out about take a the shot from uh, here. grave. Good call. Now it's picture time. Ready or not? Ooh. Ah, and Iris got to join. That's awesome. I love that one. Yes. We ought to hold on to this one. I just, I don't know. I... Where is his grave? 
Is that it? Oh, there it is, fam! Oh. Jared Hester. That's what his last name is. Hester. Gallant, steward, and loving grandfather. Hey, thank you, Jared, honestly. I mean, you and Talkid and stuff. You served Noctis' as father and you even kept quiet about things going on. You gave us a place to stay and stuff and helped us along our way. I appreciate it, man. And I'm gonna get revenge for the fact that they took your life. I think that was wrong. Alright, fam. I'm sorry. Thanks for everything. Yeah, Noctis. One guy who killed him. He doesn't deserve to be around. Once I find him, I'm gonna make sure he's locked up for good. But let's continue this quest because we gotta go to Altisha. I'm sure we'll run into him eventually. What's up? Sid! Hand over the scraps to- Oh yeah, to upgrade the drain lance! Oh, that was back in the first episode! Oh, I'm so for- I forgot all about it. It was the second episode, but I forgot Proceed all about that. thanks. Y'all just leave the rest to me. I can upgrade Here she these is. things. Try her out and let me know what you think. Oh, I want to see what it looks like. Hold on. So I go to my gear. Noctis. What does the pole look like? Train lines to an upgraded version of a unique pole on crafted with insomnia and technology. Absorbs the elemental powers of defeated foes. Well, it's definitely more powerful than um, than a javelin. Can you upgrade other things? Back in a new piece, are you? If you want it done up right, you bring me the right parts. Um. A master mechanic, Sid can modify mechanicized weapons to unleash their full potential. If Noctis can obtain a rested bit, Sid will upgrade the engine blade. Okay. Oh, hand over the rested bit to upgrade the engine blade. You got yes! what I need. I'll take it from here. Sweet. Remember, practice makes perfect. Huh. Fixing an upgrade? Can do. A better engine blade too? A glass gemstone to get the second one upgraded? Alright. I give oh, you Oh, I've gotta upgrade it again! Oh, I did not I could do this! How you Oh! Y'all brace yourself for power! Oh! Y'all brace yourself for power! Oh, we've already upgraded everything we can. Are you serious? Hold on. What does it look like? Oh, gear. Hold on. We don't have it. No, he said come back in a few days and I'll have it. Ah, we all ready for our pot. There y'all are. Get ready to be blown away. Oh, sweet. Better engine blade too. Wait, there's a three? Well, looks like we got some new gearheads in the making. Upgrade the engine blade three. Oh, we have an engine blade three and they can upgrade it to a four. Oh my gosh. What? How powerful can this blade get? Stand up straight. You slacking off. So. Not yet. Let me check it out. Go to gear. Knock this. <gasps> Look at the difference in attack. Holy crud, fam. Look at this. Oh, that's awesome. I wonder how much more powerful it can get. Alright, guys. Ready to depart. To Altisha. 
Hey, it's Umbra. Hey, what's up, boy? How's it going? Waiting for you and Altisha. Getting ready to sell them for you. Quick question. How is Umbra getting... Okay, if if we have to sail to there, how is Umbra getting back, for, back and forth here? I actually haven't figured that out yet. Huh? Whoa, wait. <gasps> it's going down! What? Whoa, dude, it's underground? Our ship is underground? What? Well, you guys see this? Whoa, it's got a massive, massive way a staircase that goes down. Whoa, ooh, item. Helio <laughs> Look, Prince Noctis, Talk even it. the Marshal came to say goodbye. The Marshal's here? What's up, buddy? Oop, they didn't let me talk. I heard the Regalia is going on the boat with you. Is it? Must be a pretty dang big boat. Iris, what's up? I guess it's goodbye for now. Oh. I know Prompto keeps knocking into you, but you can look. Look, her eyes are even red. Oh. She's upset. Man. Hold on, before we do that, what's this over here? Cosmology. Or rotted soil under blighted sky. A dread plague the wicked has wrought. In the light of the gods, sword swan at his side. Against the dark, the king's battle is fought. From the heaven high to the blessed below shines the beam of a peace long besought. Long live thy line and this stone divine for the night when all comes to naught. 15 to Nadir. I don't know what that is. Is there anything else over here? I don't see anything else. This is crazy. Where's the marshal? Something I gotta get off my chest. <sighs> What's that? I'm sorry. Sorry I wasn't there for your father. Oh. I swore an oath to protect the king, but uh, I wasn't strong enough to uphold it. <sighs> Ain't nothing nobody could have done to stop what happened. Yeah. I realize that. But you need to realize just what you mean to the boys by your side. I do. Even if they can't solve your problems, you can't hide what's going on from them. It hurts like hell. Remember, those ain't your bodyguards. They're your brothers. Trust in them, always. Wow. I, I will. Wow, that cuts deep. Gladio. Prompto, Ignis. Let's do it, guys. I'll remember that. There's gotta be a reason you guys are with me. And are sticking with me, besides the fact that we're tied together by oaths and stuff. I appreciate everything, guys. I really do. Alright. Ugh. <sighs> 
You can never have too many tools. Here, learn to wield not only weapons, but magic as well. Thank you. Thank you. The Regalia is already waiting below deck. Do we have to say goodbye? I hate saying goodbye. Talk it. You didn't forget to pack anything, did you? Only my socks and underwear. <laughs> Only my socks and underwear. Alright guys, let's go. Onto the boat, right? Waiting for an invitation? Get your asses on board! We're going. Alright, Sid, we're on our way. Hey! Your Majesty! Yeah, Talkin? What's up? Please! Come back soon! We need our king! Uh, yeah! Count on it! Will do, buddy. Take care, little man. See you, Iris. I'll come back, I promise. I promise I will. That's kind of a cool picture. Oh, the scenery. <laughs> Look at that. That's a nice picture. Oh, look at that, fam. Now that's a cool picture right there. Real Plaza Altisha. Oh, that's Ravis. And the Chancellor. The wedding day arrives, but alas, without the bride. Of course, we've come for the Hydrian. And you've gone to such lengths to prepare. Merely my duty. Ah, but for an outsider to lead the Imperial Army must be a battle in and of itself. You've spoken to Lady Luna Freya. No. That obstinate secretary, standing in the way, while you rush off to slay the Hydrian for your poor sister's sake. Why do you have to do that? I know the price of the Covenant. The Covenant? What the heck is that? I don't know. Whoa! You know I've always wanted to go sailing like this. Not many opportunities living in insomnia. Whoa, look here it's at just this. us in the horizon. It's amazing. It's life changing. There's Chased quite a ways to go until There's we reach that our Tisha, so keep gushing to your heart's content. <gasps> when we step off the boat, we'll be in a foreign country. The anticipation alone is a foreign sensation. That's where, that's where our Tisha is. This it is, is where we were headed to begin with. They've been through a lot. And there's still more to come. So next on the docket is Leviathan. What sort of Leviathan. deity are we dealing with? A serpent said to embody the roar and rage of the sea. And we'll have to see for ourselves. Can't let Lady Luna Freya do all the heavy lifting. You must be so psyched to see her. Luna? Yeah. Well, we need to make sure she's alright before anything else. Indeed. Her well-being is top priority. Don't like this going down on Imperial turf. You think Lady Lunafreya's in danger there? The Empire did invade Lucis for the ring. I have no faith their ruthless ambitions will stop short of harming the Oracle. Without the ring, the crystal's no more than a rock. Hmm, I suppose. Does anyone know how Lady Lunafreya came to have the ring? It seems likely His Majesty entrusted it to her safekeeping back at the Crown City. So she's held on to it this whole time, all the way to Altitia. The ring Probably. is important, and so is Leviathan. But Luna comes first. You know, I was thinking back to our encounter with Ravus. 
Hmm. Do you recall an apparatus in place of his arm? Yeah, I remember. Seems he lost his, his old one in the invasion. But in its place, he seems to have acquired new power. Power? That would help explain how a son of Tenebrae suddenly came to command Niflheim's army. Now that you mention it, That's his true. strength did seem sort of supernatural. I just chalked it up to the Oracle lineage. His ancestry may be part of it, but that alone wouldn't account for his freakish strength. I wonder what could have happened to him. There's a disturbing rumor about. Lord Ravus has taken to brandishing his majesty's sword. My dad? Then what's the Whoa. big idea behind that? That his power's the same as the power of kings? I cannot say for sure, but I have my doubts. Ravus wears the sword, but doesn't wield it. For all his newfound powers, he's still the Chancellor's lapdog, holding on to the enemy king's sword like some badge of honor. It might help if we knew what he was after. Right. What are the odds the Empire will crash the pool party with Leviathan? Consider it a guarantee. Die. They felled a god to prevent Noct from receiving his blessing. And they'll do so again. But we beat him to the big guy. Thanks to our friendly guide. Never know which way that one's gonna move next. The Chancellor right. has an agenda all his own. Sometimes it helps. Like when he called off his army and let us escape. But That's he's so still weird. a creep about it. Well, feels like he's only helping us because he wants something. Yeah, there has to be something. don't know what. Reckon we'll see him again? I don't know. Certainly but... hope not. Not your type. He no love us. lost he for bonus. As Gladio Why? said. His actions are motivated not by altruism, but by self-interest. Right. And when he does come to our aid, I see only condescension in his eyes. Yeah, can't argue with that. Ever think you think too much? Sometimes, but it's always preferable to the alternative. So, soon you'll have your old man's ring back. Yeah, when we arrive in Altitia. Good thing. To him, it was his heritage. Is that what my dad said? Carrying a royal line ain't a task to be taken lightly. For a small thing, that ring can sure weigh heavy. After he became king, I only ever saw his face in the paper. Wait, Wait weren't what? you at the coronation? No, yeah. I, I was long gone from the city. Must have been invited at least. Right. Had a fallen out of sorts with your old man. Right at the end of the trip. You did? I was given to understand you stayed in touch. We buried the hatchet years later, but never talked face to face again. Should have paid a visit while I had the chance. It's, uh... Well, no use dwelling on it now. Got the regalia in the hold, but you're all gonna stay in Altitia for a good while, right? Yes. Right. We believe so. In that case, I'll tune her up for y'all. Not that I'll have much to do, though. <laughs> well, with Cindy looking after the old girl. If you say she's good, she must be great. She was never afraid of hard work. Heaven knows she had a hard childhood. A hard childhood? He means her parents. Lost them both when she was little. It was big oh. enough to understand, though. And to hurt. But you wouldn't guess that, seeing her now. Not at all. She's always so cheerful. Well, that ought to tell you how far she's come. Well, you must have seen your fair share of Altisha by now. Yeah, only done been the once. Stayed a good while, though. What's it like? Big old city. Big, okay. Well, yeah, ain't the same. crown city. Different. Yeah. Got it. We'll see if we Big and different. Foreign lands seldom lend themselves to trite explanations. Change of scenery ought to do you good. Well, I'm all talked out. Can't be far to Altitia now, right? We'll be there in no time. Nice having the wind at our backs. Right. Lodgings are a fast order of business. All work and no play? Makes sickness a dull boy. Someone has to be with Satan, too. Well, you're welcome to sleep in the wild. Ain't no hotel, but I know a fella has a place. Hey, now. Westcombe. Ran with Reggie and me way back when. Oh, Scum. was he the other one in that photo with the garage? 
Yeah, yeah I did see that. Runs himself a diner or a cafe or something. Go and see for yourselves. Sure. And does the place have a name? McGee or Magoo or uh, Mago. That's the one. Nice. You can count on Old West. <laughs> He'll chew your ears off. The government issued a statement promising that the reasons behind awakening the Hydrian would be clarified in the ceremonial address. Got a signal! Delivering the address will be Lady Luna Freya, who was previously reported dead. This will mark her first public appearance since the violence that befell the signing ceremony. Lady Luna Freya's gonna give a speech? Sounds like it. Lord knows. This world could use some wisdom. Won't be much longer now, knocked. Yeah. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, uh, whoa! What? What? We just read this. This. What? Look at this place. We just went through the sea, and it's being carried. Oh, man. Does this vessel have an entry permit? Uh, entry permit? Relax. I got one. Here. That's as old as they get. Seems in order. You may pass. Yeah, that could have been bad. Oh. Prepared in advance. Could say that. Thirty odd years ago. That's what the guy meant by old. Lucky us, huh? That could have ended badly. Oh, look at this place! Fam! This reminds me of, like, seeing Venice. It's a city of water. No wonder it's known for like Leviathan and stuff like that. Oh. All right, well, fam, we're gonna end it off here, and uh, when we start off, we'll start our adventure in Altitia. Guys, that was awesome. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Okay. Thank you guys for subscribing and uh, watching my video. I appreciate everything, and I'll talk to you later.